Hello, today we'll discuss some very important tips. So these tips are not specific to testing, but uh, they can be generic, though they were given in the book related to testing tips. But I found them, they, they are generic, they can be followed by any person doing anything. So I have separated them out from the testing tips. So if you do all of them daily or few of them, if you bring all those tips in your career, in your life, then they will definitely help you. I keep on going through them. So uh, let's begin. My name is Gaurav Khurana. And if you are coming for the first time, you can subscribe to my channel. Okay, this is a big mind map. As I always tell, it take two, three minutes to load on my system. So let's see what are those uh, tips. Let me expand all of this. The shortcut in X mind is you just have to press star. So all of this would get expanded like you see. Okay, the first point is be passionate about learning. So there is an example that people have quoted about Dave and Prince of Persia. I'll share my story here that in Dave, there is a, a round, round four where we always used to get killed and we thought that the game is ending here. We are never used to cross that dragon who used to fire on us. And one day, and then, then also I keep on playing till that round. But one day I got collided with that dragon and it got killed. And then we found the whole way around it. So it's the learning is just like that, that you have to uh, keep on doing it. Even if you fail again, you start with double enthusiasm like you used to do in your childhood for uh, those games. Be thankful and be grateful and stay humble, whatever and however knowledge and whatever awards you get, but uh, always remain grounded. Ask for things like I have seen this uh, once like uh, somebody it happened with some of them in my team in one of the organization that uh, the person uh, never asked for promotion. So during the discussion, the his lead or manager told him you never told me. Right. So if you are expecting something, do ask it like yeah, just, this is just an example and you should have a growth mindset. That means you can learn and you can improve whatever you know or whatever you don't know for all those things. Right. And first, always be you. So don't compare because you will find so many YouTubers and so many people like who you think that they are better than you. Right. And if you start comparing and then the next point, you will go in that overthinking loop and it kills. Right. So don't go in that. Just try to be a better, better version of yourself, right? You should be better than what you were in a previous week or in a previous month. And if you have not started also now, start from now, okay? And you should update your skill set constantly. And there are two things written here, right? Technology is changing every day. Just with Selenium or just with one tool, you cannot uh, stay forever, right? You have to start uh, learning new things because the technology is coming very fast right and also become a better tester because somebody in the community was telling that everybody is learning automation and there can be a day coming where uh, you want good testers who are not just they don't they are automation experts or tools expert you need better testers so keep on working on these two things if you are into testing and technology is for everyone Right. And if you're not able to reach your goals in time, you have thought of that. OK, you will learn in 2021 Kubernetes or any such things, Docker. OK, don't stop. Uh, start from where you paused or if you did not start it, start now. Consult people, maybe your seniors or experts who might not be your seniors. They can be your juniors, but they know something. So do consult them. And paying people like who are industry leaders, I have seen people, they do reply and uh, nobody, uh, maybe there are some people who, who might not have be having time, but uh, people do reply. Right? So you can get their advice. And sometimes if you don't know anything, even if you are there in the industry for 10 years, 50, it's fine to say no, right? Nothing can happen. And this is a very good thing. Like uh, it is, it is helping me. I can directly tell you when I make these videos, it helps me because I go through uh, this content and again I go through while editing and all that stuff so it, it really helps and you see that because it helps you in recall revisit it can increase your understanding I see Jyoti who is taking uh, every Saturday she takes class on AWS in the test chat community for free right 
So there she must be doing some homework, right? Because people ask different questions and all. So it helps. And the main point is this, right? Why many people don't take it because you think that you can be wrong. Yeah, if you can be wrong, but do accept it at places. If you are wrong, people people are there to correct you, right? But that way it will help you. And uh, you can write blogs on Medium. There are so many uh, platforms that are available these days, like LinkedIn, WordPress, anywhere. Right. And yeah, this is a very important point. I think Sachin Sharma gave this point that there is a difference between information and knowledge. You can have information about everything, right? I can know that API testing can be done by Karate, Rest Assured, Postman, and so many other tools or the libraries like Request in Python. But uh, some things like that information is like I know, but not the detail of all those tools, right? but there must be something where I should have knowledge of it so that I can implement it as well, right? Uh, at some places, just information will not suffice, right? I can just, then you'll feel that I'm just talking. I don't have the base knowledge on how to do it on the ground, right? So it's important that uh, whatever field you are working in, you will upgrade over there, whatever industry you are in, right? And whatever work stream you are in. So all those things you should keep on upgrading and you should have detailed knowledge of that not only just the information, right? What we call like domain knowledge uh, for the field area, right? So that is a good advice. And become so confident in who you are so that people can't, uh, sometimes people get affected by if somebody said something uh, to them, like they reject their opinion, like for example, many people hate BDD, right? So it's there or how you are implementing it, right? It might have helped someone, right? So they have their own opinion rejection behavior. So do accept things, but at the same time, don't get disheartened or uh, uh, or felt bad, like because of the opinion and rejections of people. Set short-term goals, they help, right? Uh, you do. You should have long-term as well as some short-term goals. So this is just an example, six months, even you can have monthly or quarterly goals that will help you uh, in achieving a target, right? And how long you should try until you succeed, right? Keep on trying, keep on trying, and you can learn anything. Okay, firstly, any war, you first win it in your mind, right? So here it's, uh, it, it's being written that uh, the biggest wall that you have created between your success or between your happiness or between you or anything is uh, created by you and that too in your mind. Okay, and do some sessions like in this distracted world, you can follow Pomodoro. So what is that is, so there are softwares and mobile apps as well. For example, I started this so that I can focus on creating this video. And meanwhile, I'll not attend any WhatsApp or Telegram or whatever things, or I'll not check my mailbox for that time. Uh, unless it's urgent or somebody is calling you, it's fine. But this is a way uh, so that you can uh, remain focused for that time. If you can't do for 90 minutes, you can create a small one. I created for 25 minutes or you can create like that. Okay, or you can just uh, track by timing as well. There is no need of the software. I'll add that uh, description in the link and there are browser version also available for such software. Yeah, dream big. How good you can become and how high can you, you can rise, right? You can be CEO of the company or whatever uh, dream you have even higher than that, be the president of the country also. So there is no limitation in thinking of thinking big, right? So this one is same as ever tried, failed, no matter. Try again, there is no problem, right? If, even if you failed, yeah, uh, because there is no mistakes in life. There are only lessons learned, right? Climb it, go through it or work around it, right? So that uh, you are not stuck on it. You are not overthinking about it. Set goals like a boss. And this is one of the very good quote that the moment you are ready to quit is usually the moment before the miracle happens, right? So don't quit. Maybe the miracle is just going to happen for you. Maybe you are rejected in 10 interviews, but maybe the 11th one is the one which will work for you. Uh, be proud of your work, right? Until you are not proud of how others can uh, think like I have seen Sanjay who has created the selector sub which is very useful. And then he created another tool test case studio, which helps you in, it creates the steps for whatever you are doing online. So he's proud of his work, right? Firstly, he has to proud and then others will feel proud, right? Uh, here, uh, somebody gave this example that, right? Uh, you will always, if you, if Hunter will tell you the story, he will always glorify himself, right? You have to be the lion and start writing, telling, sharing things. 
Okay, let me continue. Okay, uh, don't give the control of your life or your things in other people's hand, like somebody said you anything. Don't take it uh, to the heart, right? They should not tell you what you can do and what you can't do. You can do anything, right? As we discussed earlier, you can dream big and you can convert your weaknesses to strength, right? Be coachable, like uh, you, even if you are the expert in your field, don't think that you know everything. You have some personal blind spot, some situation you, you might have uh, not seen, right? And the person is telling you the positive intent. So be coachable, right? And try to get team's collective decision. At times you take decision and inform people. But uh, if you are leading or you are a manager, take decision, involve your team. It, everybody, uh, you cannot satisfy all right. All the 10 people, they have different opinions, but at least you have consulted them and you have to bring a balance. Keep on improving. That's a very basic constant learning and CI, what you call constant improvement and CL constant learning. So it begins with I, when you are expecting others to improve, start with you as well, right? What you can improve and take feedback from your team. And yes, as I said earlier, also like there are no mistakes in life, only lessons learned. So never hesitate to accept uh, that you did a mistake. It's fine. Learn from them, right? No one knows everything. Uh, you can, maybe you are an expert in your field, then the other people might not that particular situation or that field, right? And failure can give you lessons which success cannot give when everything is successful. Generally, we don't do RC, right? But where, when there is failure, you'll find so many problems were there. So those are actually the learnings, right? So, and don't create the, like, if you failed once, don't think that you will always, uh, and you are not adding skills or stopping by that. Don't do that. And in your careers, because you are a constant learner, you always think that I'm just a child and I have to learn and grow and so many things. And it happens over time. Don't think that it will happen overnight. And, and just by thinking it will not happen. You have to uh, do some actions. Patience level, uh, yes, it is very important in anything, testing, reading, writing, or anything uh, that needed your time and attention. So that is also uh, one of the important thing in life, not only in your career, it's it's important in life. So this is also one of the point which is recently given by Josley even, who is a very, very good tester. He's a community moderator in for the test tribe. So he says that you have to be a good listener. Right. And it was given in the testing tips book as well that uh, sometimes what happens is it happens with me as well. Right. I'm working on that uh, thing that whenever somebody is telling you uh, in the back of the mind, you are preparing your answer that when, when the person will stop, I will answer that instead of listening to that. So to become a better tester, you can for forming more scenarios and to understand the other person, it's important to have the listening skills. Right. So work on that. And not only learn, like you you watch videos, playlist for automation or for anything, try to implement it, right? So be it anything, maybe you are growing your wealth, you are reading some videos about stocks, mutual funds or anything in life, right? You have to execute that learning, try it out, how it works, right? Invest in that learning. You done some API, try to execute, do some challenges. Like I have a video on 30 days of Postman, where if you have learned Postman, you can implement it. Right. I'll share the link for that and do share it with others uh, because they might share their perspective and then you will learn even more. Be calm at all the times, right? Uh, so that way you will learn that how you can respond to situation, then react. If you have this uh, calmness in you, practice it and it will enhance your thinking, right? And don't try to achieve that perfection that I should know everything and uh, like that, right? There is a good balance and you can prioritize that. And you have to be continuous improvement culture and continuous learning as well. Okay, coming to the point, like how you can manage conflicts if you are a leader or a manager, like, so when conflicts will happen, like when you are trying to solve a problem and there are multiple uh, people involved and you have to agree on a plan and people have different opinions, right? So have the solution, identify the problem, don't uh, uh, address address the issue, not the person, right? So like generally it happens when you're doing RCA that, okay, testing team missed it or development team missed it. So what was missed is the point and where it can be caught, right? That is the thing other than who missed it, 
right uh, instead of that you can uh, you can oh, address the issue not the person and if it is going it uh, like here what's it written like if it is going in a totally wrong direction right avoid it avoid that conflict right if you can't uh, solve those kind of thing avoid going in that way okay it's not about who is right it's about like what is right uh, you can focus on the problem than the person self love is important take care of yourself right and take breaks in between whatever you are doing creating videos blogging youtube uh, participating in community events take breaks so that uh, you you have a balanced life and if you have got any of these rude boss rude lead take them positively yeah sometimes it teaches you a lot like you know that i can handle these situations once you uh, cross that so hope you must have liked the uh, uh, these generic advice which were given by testers i have not put them in test data or automation in any of those places but a uh, separate video just for this because they were really uh, i can say life changing some of them are so thank you for watching and this is my channel and this is my blog here i write and on this channel i create videos do subscribe to it and i'll be keep on creating more such videos or different things do comments uh, do comment on this video and check out the description to check out more videos thank you for watching